What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. And a lot of people been asking me about Young Chop. I'm not going to lie. I got a small concern for Young Chop. You know, I just got off his live. Uh, I want to be honest, you know. I understand Chopper legend in this shit. And if you look a little deeper, you kind of understand where he coming from. It's a lot of people bit his style and became very, very successful. Multi-millionaires and shit like that. It was a lot of producers who famous right now who kind of looked up to Young Chop. And that's the reason why he was going kind of hard and shit, you know, on people and shit like that. Uh, he even kind of got down like on people he was working with. I don't think people understand that he gave Lil Durk a nice sound in the beginning and shit like that. So you feel like a lot of people owe him, you know. London then stole his whole way of making beats. New York then took his style of beats. It's a lot of artists that took his style of beats and made a career with that shit. So I can understand Young Chop being a little irritated, but I was just on his live, right? And there's just something off about that shit. You know, I don't know if, you know, he just woke up in the morning or he was having a bad day or people just got on his Instagram live and kind of said things before he can really fix it. But, you know, he was kind of like on live letting people get on there, disrespect King Von. You know, disrespect Nooski, disrespect people. And it seems like it's an issue with Lil Durk and Young Chop. I get it, you know, but, you know, it's a piece of me that's a little worried about Young Chop now, you know, because he comes from the culture. He from that shit. A lot of these people, his homeboy, a lot of these people became successful because of the beats that Chop had made. So I just think that was very, very concerning to me. I don't know if it's nothing personal. I remember King Von getting on his live, and I'm not gonna lie, he kind of irritated King Von on that live with Young Chop and King Von. You can tell, cause King Von energy changed quick. He was kind of smiling with Chop on the phone, but Chop kept saying shit like, "Go on, send me some money then." You say you gonna send me some money, send me some money then, and you can tell his smile went from smiling to like that. So you can tell that you know Chop kind of irritated Von. Then Lil Durk was kind of giving Von advice. I mean, giving. Chop advice. Chop kind of threw Lil Durk under the bus, saying he gonna be telling and all that shit when it came to the interview that Durk did with Gilly the Kid. So, you know, Young Chop be giving his opinion on certain situations. I'm not sure exactly what's gonna lead to that, what's gonna be the outcome. But uh, if you can, man, hit the subscribe button to my YouTube channel. I'm gonna keep you updated on that. I don't wanna start no rumors about Young Chop because I think Young Chop is dope. I think he a legend, so I don't want him to take this video the wrong way, but I got to be transparent with the viewers. It was a weird vibe I got on his on his live that day. Subscribe to my channel. It's the homie True Teller, the street reporter.